Okay, so for the first stage of reading, to make sure that we've got things clear and on a good foundation, we're going to take only the short vowel sounds, and we're going to make three-letter words to start with using consonants on either side of a vowel. So we're going to, like, let's take the first vowel, A. Okay, we're going to put an A here. Sorry, I'm, I really am left-handed. I'm going to put an A, and we're going to, Look at the consonants. That's all the letters that are not vowels. And we're going to take and see if we can make a three-letter word with one consonant on one side and one consonant on the other. So in this case, I might take a T, t a T sound, put a T here. Okay? And then I might take a, another consonant say, that would work, like say a G. Okay? And put a G here and, and make a word. In this case, t -ag tag. And that's how that, and you know, the common word people like to put is they put an A and then they put a C for a sound and then they put a T for a T sound and make a sound k -at cat. Okay, and that's how you make three letter words, which is a really good exercise to really get the basics of short vowel sounds. Okay. We could do another one for C. I should probably do this with my right hand. A, R. Say R is another consonant. And K, R, car. Okay, and that's how we do three-letter words. Now that's what the A, E. Right, you could put a put a E there. Whoops. I'm going to put one word for each, say E, we have a, could put a P here for a P, a P sound, P, put, put a T, pet, okay, there we spell, I'm going to let you put two more on, hopefully you have a paper somewhere, you can write two more three letter words with a short E sound, let's try a short I sound, I, how about, we'll put an I here, and how about, put an S, that gives a sound, and then I, and then a P. And this says sip, sip. Okay, I'm going to let you find two more words that has a short I sound. And that's our next vowel, A, E, I, O. So we're going to go with O. So let's put an O here. And we could put a consonant here, maybe a P. And then an another consonant. Maybe we could put another P. Right here, and then that would make a the word pop, pop, and then you could go ahead and put two more uh, short O sound words with three letters, okay? O, U, okay? How about U? Could do the same thing with U on here and put a a P and another P and make the word pup, pup, okay? So go ahead and try two more. You could put maybe some other words. Okay, so practice with that. Make sure you've got that down. There's if you're if you feel like this is the stage you're at in your reading, then let me know that you want to do stage one. Okay, I should just write this on that this is stage one. All right, I'm, I'm telling you now, it's stage one. Let me know you want to work on stage one because I have some readers that are excellent. For this stage and it'll really give you a good foundation if you feel like this is something sort of new to you but you know maybe not all the way new but partly new a little wobbly on it let's start here with you and just let me know give me a call tell me you you want to do stage one you want to work on stage one get really good at it i'll bring a reader or get you in touch with someone who's got the reader for this stage and we'll work on it okay